Are you awake now? <laughs> good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's having a good uh, Saturday morning. Uh, appreciate you guys being here. Saw a bunch of people in the chat already. Trev, good morning, sir. Shop for Comics is here. Jacob, appreciate you guys being here this morning. Um, you know, we've got our usual stuff we're going to get to today. Uh, Comics by the Bay, Marvel Matt, good morning. Lucretius is here. Morning. Uh, Cole, yeah, Cole and I were chatting earlier on, on Instagram. Chop, good morning, Chop. Hope you're doing well. Dope is here. Dope, you're going to be on Only Slabs, right? I think it's, did we, did Rob move the schedule from today to, to tomorrow? I know he got a special Halloween edition, so definitely let us know so we can check that. Definitely don't want to miss that. Always, uh, always enjoy seeing all of the pre-code horror slabs from you. Tylox the Mighty. Tylox has got a <clears throat> hangout stream tonight at uh, 7 p.m. Eastern. So definitely go stop by him and check him out. Master is here. Good morning. Caught him on the comic book crowd show with Anachronic Comics last night. Big discussion about She-Hulk and the Marvel Disney Plus shows. Pretty interesting. So definitely go check that out if you haven't seen it. Zach is here. Durs is here. Good morning. Comic Cap. I think Comic Cap is on his way to a... Uh, I think there's a show uh, today, right? Comic, uh, local comic show for you in Jersey. I know there's one here on Long Island, um, but uh, I between New York City Comic Con a couple weeks ago and the C3 event last last week, I spent way too much money. So I'm uh, I'm pumping the brakes on buying any new any more comics right 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 now. So Matt is here. Appreciate Matt. Yeah, I did a bunch of uh, stuff around the house yesterday, getting ready, you know, raking some leaves, getting things buttoned up for the the winter on the East Coast. So, yes, <laughs> I know the feeling, Matt. Kyle is here. Good morning, Kyle. Saw a bunch of guys hanging out last night, too, in the um, – a bunch of people had live streams last night. DJ, uh, Comic Journey was live. You know, Joe, Anachronic Comics had his show. Comic Joe, good morning. Appreciate you being here. Oh, and there's Mr. Jimmy G. And in honor of Jimmy G, we need to play the LCS dancers. You down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? Who's down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? You down with LCS? Who down with LCS? So, Jimmy, that's for you. Uh, <laughs> so, all right. So, Dope will be on Only Slabs tomorrow. So, usually Rob does a show on Saturday, but they bumped it to Sunday, same time. Uh, so, that's a, that's a must-watch uh, show. Great, um, uh, you know, Dope has some amazing books that the one thing I love about watching his channel, it's books that I typically don't see because I'm not a big horror guy and he's collecting, you know, pre-code horror. So it's, it's books that are, you know, old, older than dirt and, uh, <laughs> some great books to see. Uh, just, oh, Madam is here. Good morning, Madam. Madam was, uh, Madam was on the comic book crowd last night as well. I think she's got some homework from that show. She's got some Disney Plus shows to watch now. Oh, okay, yeah, your con your show is next week. Yeah, I there there is uh, I think there's one this this today actually. Like I said, on Long Island and a few others. So, Dale, good morning. I I, don't know, I think I saw your comment, but didn't shout you help. Appreciate you being here. Um, I know just you know a quick thank you or a, not a quick thank you, but a big thank you to everybody who participated in the C three event uh, last. Um, Last weekend, uh, especially on uh, on my show, uh, Madam and Phil and uh, Naman, who who did some artwork for us, uh, and just all of the donations. I think we raised over five hundred dollars just on my show alone, and the the overall event raised 
um, you know, well over $20,000. So crush the goal of 10. So really cool, really appreciate, you know, uh, great to see the community, you know, support. Uh, and I saw a bunch of people, you know, bought, picking up some, some great, uh, slabs and artwork and books, uh, on really, some really great prices, but, um, you know, everything was going to, um, charity. So it was, it was really good to see Adam. Good morning, sir. Appreciate you being here. <laughs> yeah, I got to watch, uh, I got to watch your video from last night, your Friday uh, video. I have it in my queue to watch show. <laughs> Happy birthday to uh, Comic Journey. We're, we're doing that again. <laughs> All right, just catching up, making sure our Neil is here. Good morning, Neil. Appreciate you being here. Uh, Fanboy Prime is here. Yes, thanks, Kyle. Yeah, a few people mentioned to me. Um, yep, I had sent her an email. I jumped back into her stream last night. I was jumping around, so I, I guess I won, a, I won some books or I won some cards on uh, Diamond Princess's channel last night. Um, so I sent her an email with my address, but I appreciate that. A few, like I said, a few other people mentioned that. So I appreciate that. Um, I was bouncing around to a bunch of the live streams last night, trying to, you know, support as much as I could. David's here. Good morning, sir. Appreciate you being here. Um, and so last week we had, you know, kind of a, a special show. We, you know, we were supporting the C3 event. Um, and so we gave away some stuff, but we didn't do our normal giveaway that we usually do on our Saturday morning show. So I'm going to do two today. So I'm going to share my screen and we're going to get right to one uh, this morning. So I just hit 800 subs. Uh, really appreciate that. Uh, and along with the 800 subs, I have a, a, a video out. If you guys could go check it out and the links are down in the description below um, for all the channels. So uh, in order to kind of trigger my giveaway, I've asked that you go support uh, some other channels in the community that are trying to hit some milestones. Um, so all of the links are down in this video uh, and also in the 800 subscriber video. So please go check that out, support them, I think. So I had five, uh, let me double check that. because I'm, I'm, I'm drawing a blank on the numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six channels uh, that I asked uh, you guys to go subscribe to. And I think we've hit, uh, I think at least three of them have hit their subscriber goals that I set for them. So, um, so definitely go check them out. We, you know, a few of them are in the shop for comics, uh, was one of them, uh, collecting with theirs, uh, Zach's collections, uh, a couple of the channels. Uh, <laughs> well, I know, I, I think, I think you have to watch Loki, right? Uh, I think that was your homework from, uh, from last night's show. <laughs> so 23, good morning. So we've got 20 of 26 entries. Yeah, I'm just, I'm way behind on the chat catching up. Gene is here. Good morning, Gene. Appreciate you being here. Uh, Phil, there's Phil. And Phil has his show uh, following mine here at 11 a.m., so definitely go check him out. Making sure I'm not missing anybody in the chat. Thank you. Appreciate that. Um Oh, nice. Okay, good, good. Yeah, I haven't checked uh, this morning, so I, de I definitely want to go check. So we definitely we're getting close. Um, so hopefully, uh, you know, we can. Cat fan is here. Good morning, and Cat fan was one of the channels too that I shouted out uh, in the 800 subscriber giveaway. So trying to get his bump up his subscription his numbers as well. Just making sure uh, I'm not missing anybody. <laughs> Well, that's good. I'm glad, I'm glad, you know, I'm glad it, it's helped. I, you know, I took a page out of, um, I took a page out of, uh, the comic vet. He did something similar for his 800, uh, subscriber giveaway. So wanted to, to do that as well. Sean is, uh, Sean is here. Slim. Good morning. Yes. Tylox and I are going head to head in our fantasy football, fantasy football league, uh, this week. All right. So let's, uh, Let's run the giveaway. <laughs> Madam, congrats. Um, all right. So uh, restock the short box. It is, it, it is brimming with 
new books. So let's see what we get. Uh, first up, Batman number 92. Oh, here we go. Uh, issue. This is Metal Society. Issue number one. I heard this was a really good series. Um, robots have uh, taken over and now the humans are fighting for their existence, I believe. Uh, I heard that was really good. I have not read that myself, but I know that was. Here's an image. Savior number one. All right, we've got we've got two more. Oh, here I go. That's a free comic book day, Blade Runner. So with a free comic book day book, we get to pull another book. Oh, this is a book that I just recently uh, added, Ocean Master. This is the uh, DC. All right, now we've got one more, one more. Trying to, let's see. Uh, where are we going? Where are we going? All right. So we've got Hawkeye and Moon Knight number three. All right. Congrats, madam. We're gonna do uh, we're gonna do another giveaway. Like I said, since we didn't do one last week, we'll we will do another one. So we'll do that about halfway through the show. Let me just put madam's books on the side. So congrats. Appreciate that. Um, so, um, like I said, the shout outs. Uh, well, why don't, why, don't we, uh, why don't we serve up some breakfast, right? We, I know uh, Comics by the Bay already had breakfast, but we'll, we'll, serve up, uh, we'll serve up some breakfast. <laughs> no floppy bacon, only crispy bacon in, uh, in, in, in this house. Hash browns. Yes. I need to, I need to expand the, uh, expand the menu. I know, I think, uh, comics by the bay was talking about some uh, bagels earlier and I'll have to, uh, I'll have to add some of that. So I still haven't found any, uh, biscuits and gravy. Um, <laughs> Yeah, and we always try to do you know a healthy a healthy option as well. So um, appreciate you guys uh, being here. Um, like I said, uh, we were talking shout outs, right? So shout outs to this week's shout outs are all of the channels from my 800 subscriber giveaway. So um, couple couple names that you probably heard before: Das Comics, uh, and all the links are down down below. JDA Three Comics, Collecting with Durs, who's in the chat. Shop for Comics, uh, who's here, Cat Fan Comics Man, and Zach's Collections. So definitely go check out those channels. Uh, we definitely, if you're not familiar with them, we, we want to try to ha help them hit some subscriber goals that I set. And once all six channels hit that, we'll trigger my 800 subscriber giveaway, giving away some raw books and some uh, Spider-Man slab. So if you guys want to participate, please go check out that video. Um and there's one other um, one other channel that I wanted to highlight. It was Switch Comics. So I'm sure you guys are familiar with uh, Marco and his brother Chris. And they, I'm going to drop this link here. They just did um, they did a, a little short film. Um, so they did a for Halloween. They did a Moon Knight Werewolf uh, short film. Uh, you definitely got to go check it out. Uh, just drop the link in the chat. Uh, it's also in the description. So you definitely want to go support them. 
They did, you know, some great work, uh, great editing, sound editing, some, some great sound effects in the, um, in the, um, in that video. Um, so definitely go check it out. I know, I know Marco and Chris worked really hard on it and I definitely want as many people to see it as possible. So, uh, and I think he's got a giveaway in that video. He's doing a giveaway as well. So definitely go check it out. Um, <laughs> I appreciate that. Yeah. I, I, I mean, it's certainly, um, humbling to hear that. And, uh, you know, a few people have mentioned that, that I, I was the, um, you know, motivator or inspiration, however you want to say it for them starting their channel or to keep their channel going. So I, I, I mean, I, <laughs> that's pretty, uh, you know, pretty amazing to, um, you know, to hear because, uh, you know, I'm just doing this for, for the fun of it and to stay connected with the community and, and, and comic books. And so to hear that I have helped, um, you know, help somebody in that way is just, uh, it's pretty cool. It's, it, but it's, I, I, I really do appreciate that. I never, never thought that, um, you know, my channel or what I'm doing would, would, would be that way. So that's, uh, I, I do really do appreciate that. Um, yeah, that's right. Uh, main event has a big, uh, a big, uh, Halloween, uh, havoc, uh, special, uh, wrestling video going on. You got Neil, up against a surfer, and I will be battling the mustache himself, Cole. Um, I, I'm not worried. I, I'm not worried. I mean, I see, uh, you know, I see how much Cole uh, eats and drinks at, uh, over there. So uh, I think Thursday, thir Thirsty Thursday, he, you know, he was drinking some some bourbon or something. So I'm not really, uh, I'm not, I'm, I'm not afraid. <laughs> Trev, I appreciate that. And you've mentioned that to me. I, I, that really means, that means a lot to me. I mean, because like I said, I just, um, you know, I'm doing this channel for, for fun and, and stay connected with the hobby. And then, you know, you stumble into this great community. So to hear, to hear that is really cool. So, um, <laughs> well, that's good. <laughs> that's cool. Mojo is here. Good morning. Appreciate you being here. He was uh, playing some uh, new Modern Warfare, the Call of Duty show this morning. So, uh, all right, just trying to catch up on the chat. Um, <laughs> well, I appreciate that. Yeah, I mean, you know, I, I, I and I don't feel like the, the whole grow together and just supporting other channels, I... You know, I saw that same type of support when I first started my channel. So, you know, certainly just want to pay it forward and be able to, uh, you know, help others. Right. Uh, I mean, I'm at 800. I never thought I'd be at 800. But now it's, you know, the ability to try and help, you know, other channels grow, um, grow as well. And, you know, there's definitely a lot of different pockets of the community. Um, and so sometimes people just don't know about other channels. So, I like, you know, Neil does a shout out uh, video weekly and I always find channels there. So it's, it's always great for everybody to, um, uh, I, I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know how to respond to that. <laughs> SCA, good morning. Appreciate you being here. Joe is here. Good morning, Joe. Hopefully Joe doesn't have a big to-do list today is. His wife isn't cracking the whip on him. Uh, he had a great, like I said, a great show last night. Great discussion about She-Hulk and some of the, you know, the Marvel Disney Plus shows. So definitely go check that out on the replay if you haven't watched it. Um, oh, geez. I haven't picked it up yet. Uh, I'm, I'm on the fence about uh, picking it up. So. Um, so like I said, uh, those shout outs, please go, go sub up those channels if you're not, and definitely make sure you hit the 800 subscriber giveaway. So you get entered into the contest and then go check out switch comics. Um, his, uh, little, uh, mini, mini video that he did, um, or short film. It's really well done. Uh, got a chance to watch it last night and was really, um, really impressed. Um, you know, with the work that he put in it with uh, his brother. And so just, like I said, some really great um, sound editing and it just really well done. So definitely go check that out. Um, 
<laughs> yeah, Phil, help, help Phil. He reached out, helped answer some questions. And I mean, hey, certainly if anybody ever has any questions, um, I mean, I am certainly not the, the expert, but but happy to help. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh boy. Don't don't give Cole any ideas. <laughs> yeah, that was good. It was a good show, Joe. And uh Joe has a mug with his mug on it now. So definitely go check that out. He's got the comic book crowd mugs. I mean, and they celebrated their their 12th um episode. So one year they do them monthly. So they're they've been doing it for a year. So so really cool. Um I, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to go George, the animal steal on you. I'm going to eat the, uh, I'm going to eat the turnbuckle and then spit it in your face. How's, how's that? <laughs> yeah. A bunch of, you know, and that's the thing, a bunch of channels, um, a bunch of channels are, you know, approaching milestones or trying to push for milestones. So definitely, um, I definitely will plan, you know, as, as I move forward, uh, I will definitely be doing other, um, giveaways um you know hopefully we hit 900 we'll do a giveaway then and do a very similar giveaway to help try to support other channels very um you know it's very very fun to do so <laughs> yeah the the halloween havoc it's it's a big event we've got a lot of bunch of halloween themed stuff going on this uh this weekend very cool uh, and we are two weeks away, two weeks away from the comic book community awards finishing up. Um, not a uh, finalist voting will close, uh, on November, uh, 11th. Let me just double check, make sure I've got the date, right? My dates, right? No, 12th. I'm sorry. It's 11, 12. So two weeks from today. So we are two weeks away from, you know, wrapping up the, um, Comic Book Community Awards voting, and then, you know, the committee will take a look at it, uh, and then uh, December 3rd, Saturday, December 3rd, we'll, we'll have the live stream, and the winners will be announced, so I have a bunch of things planned for that show, um, so I've got a bunch of stuff I need to get done uh, <laughs> very shortly, um, so uh, a lot of, you know, I, I've, I've reached out to the community for some uh, to create some videos and things for that live show. So really looking forward to it. Um, let's see. I'm just miss, catching up, making sure I'm not missing anything in the chat. Yeah, Gene, you know, and, it, and it's, you know, it's um, when I put together the, the 800 subscriber video, I mean, there was a ton of other channels that I could have shouted out. So I definitely want to do that again in my 900 subscriber, you know, giveaway when we get there. And highlight some other channels in the community that are, um, you know, looking to grow. So, um, pretty cool. Yes, get your votes in, please. Right, we got election day, um, election day uh, coming up too. So, you know, go go out and vote for your local politicians and and vote for the comic book community award. So, Scotty Vaughn is here. Good morning. Appreciate you being here. And Scott just had um, a great video. Uh, I guess a coworker gifted him a bunch of comic books and some, a big stack of books, some great, some great, great books in there. So, um, really cool. Yeah. Right. That's what it's all about. Supporting one another, supporting everybody and, and helping each other grow. Um, Oh, that's right. All right. Yeah. We, we're looking forward to that. Um, let's see who, see who wins big, big stakes. Good luck. <laughs> yeah i saw neil neil was in you know neil's promo video for the wrestling he was out in the yard he broke a stick i mean it looked it looked pretty uh pretty intense appreciate everybody subbing up everybody oh cat fan don't worry about it i know you've got some stuff going on you know, personally with the family. Uh, so don't, don't worry about it. I mean, we'll, you know, we'll be here. We're not going anywhere. So, you know, don't, don't, don't feel like you have to make videos if you've got other priorities. Right. Um, you know, just, just totally understand. 
So, uh oh. All right, we'll see who wins. We'll have to check that. Out. Hopefully, uh, I guess the video will be out uh, later today, so we'll definitely need to go check that out. Jay is here. Good morning, Jay. Appreciate you being here. I am way behind on the chat. Uh, let's see. Yeah, right. Don't don't stress yourself off. Right. It YouTube, the YouTube channel, the community is supposed to be fun. Um, you know, I, I try not to get. Um, worried about, you know, what's my next video I'm going to do. It kind of just kind of happens, right? Um, so don't I, I wouldn't stress yourself over it. <laughs> all right, Joe's rooting for Madam. <laughs> yeah, I think we all go through it, right? Um, you know, with videos. Um, you know. Just, I just keep doing what you're doing. Make a video when you have content or you have time. I don't try not let uh, let this be a priority over other more important things, you know, personal things, family things, that type of stuff. And it happens, right? You, you know, you have peaks and valleys with things going on personally. So, um, all right, everybody subbing everybody up. Appreciate that. Um, so like I said, yeah, comic book community awards. I just looked this morning. We have over, over 615 votes in. So definitely, um, you know, a, more than we did last year. So do, really do appreciate that. Um, and, uh, you know, we, we still have two weeks to go, so hopefully we'll get more, um, trickling in. So appreciate that. <laughs> Yeah, just yeah, uh, right. Uh, Comics by the Bay just two hundred hit two hundred subs. They did a giveaway uh, last night, and they've got uh, you know goals to hit three hundred and four hundred, and some giveaways going on. So really, really, really cool. So yeah, I mean, there, there's nothing right. Life has a way of you know every once in a while stepping up and punching you in the face, right? So <laughs> I mean, it it just it's. It happens, right? Things things happen. So, um, you know, uh, like I said, you, YouTube should be fun. I wouldn't stress about it. Um, you know, there's been plenty of people within the community that have taken, stepped away for a little while and have come back. So um, it's, you know, thing, things happen, right? Life happens. So cool. Yeah. Appreciate everybody subbing everybody up. Uh, and like I said, we're going to do, since we are two weeks away from the comic book, uh, finalist voting wrapping up, we'll do, um, let's do another giveaway. So we'll do, since last week we didn't do uh, a giveaway, we'll do, we'll do two this week. So Madam won the first. And so now we'll give everybody, uh, a chance to, uh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. Sometimes when you hit those, you know, that's that's one thing that really has helped. I think a lot of channels is just coming up with an idea of, uh, you know, a weekly type video series. Um, I think that's that's one way to kind of keep you on track. So like Catfan does his collectible comic and a collectible every day, which is which is great, you know, because it's an easy way to produce content. You kind of have a format down. You don't stress about it. So, yeah, I mean, thanks for everybody subbing up, everybody. Jimmy G, man, I hope all is well. We miss you. I understand. Yeah, Jimmy. Jimmy's a prime example, right? Life life stuff, work and everything. You know, he, he hasn't been making uh, videos in a while, but he's still, you know, he's still connected to the community. So, you know, and hopefully at one point he'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, what did I miss? <laughs> yes, let's hope, right? Let's hope they they the Giants uh, pull the trigger on some other trades and and get ready for a, a playoff run. Yeah, don't worry, Jimmy. When we we'll be we'll be we'll be looking for you when you're back. So. <laughs> All right, we've got 23 in the chat and 22 folks. I'll give you another couple seconds. If not, we'll run this giveaway. 
Oh, Dale, we can't be friends. I'm sorry. All right, let's run it. <laughs> I mean, the good thing about the NFC East this year is we've got uh, some really, um, some really great te teams. Joe, congrats! I'm not sure if Joe's won before on the channel. All right, let's go to the prize box. Maybe we can pull some uh, some DC some DC books for Joe here. Let's see. All right. Up first, we have uh, Canto, number one, a little IDW uh, title. And Joe, is Joe, is it next month in November that you're going to be doing your mystery box for uh, charity? So be on the lookout for that. Joe, Joe did one last year. Um, all right. We've got Silver Surfer Rebirth, number five. That's a great uh, Thanos cover. All right, we gotta we gotta pull some DC books for Joe. Here we go. Superboy number eighty nine. All right, some more DC magic for Joe. Oh, IDW. Monster Motors. I'm not sure what that one is. I'm not, I haven't read that before. All right, Joe, one more. Let's try to find you some DC books in here. Okay, yeah. So be on the lookout for that. Joe did that last year. Um, here we go. Superman. Number 78. Congrats, Joe. Joe, I'll reach out. Uh, I think I have your address, but I will. Um, I'll confirm it. So, congrats on your, congrats on your win. Yeah. So, be on the lookout for Joe's uh, mystery boxes. He does it. You know, does a mystery box for charity. Um, uh, you're welcome, Joe. Oh, nice. Yeah, no, and Chop, Chop's been doing a Sunday Sunday series with his son, doing some Fortnite stuff the last couple of weeks. So definitely be on the lookout for that. So, uh oh, we're we're diving into college football now. A <laughs> um, couple of books I read this week: uh, Amazing Spider-Man number twelve. Uh, I have a full review out on this. This was. Um, this was pretty good. This 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 was a good story. We've got the Hobgoblin back, um, and so um, Spidey's dealing with that, and Norman Osborn, and a bunch of stuff going on. So um, in, enjoyed it. Despite the the current Amazing Spider-Man run has been pretty good. Um, uh, you know, I think it's certainly it's certainly better than the the previous series. So. Um, vol you know, volume five. So, um, next book I read this week was, uh, Predator. This is issue three. Um, this has been a fun little series. We've got, um, the main character here on the cover, um, on a mission to hunt down some of the predators. So that's been, that's been interesting. And then aliens, uh, or alien number two. Um, this has been a pretty good read as well. Um, I, I'm expecting that we're going to kind of get a um, crossover between aliens, uh, alien and predator at some point. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I think that was a, a win, right? Didn't you get the series in a, in a win? So that's good. Yeah, that's always good when you get the complete series and can kind of uh, catch up on it. So, yeah, the predator. I, I've enjoyed the predator series. Um, it, it's been good. Is that an ongoing or is it just a, it's just a mini, a mini, I'm not sure. Um, but it, it's been fun. All right. We're, we're still, some of you guys still ch talking uh, football. <laughs> um, Captain America, symbol of truth. Uh, number six. 
Uh, this is this I've really enjoyed. It's been been a pretty pretty good series as well. Um, there, so there is this, you know, um, Sam Wilson, Cap, you know, Captain America, and then there's another, you know, um, Steve Rogers series. I dropped the Steve Rogers series. I didn't really like it. I read two or three issues and didn't care for it. But this series I've really enjoyed. Um, I like the new Falcon uh, and the that dynamic between Cap and Falcon in this series. So. That's been uh, that's been a pretty good um, a pretty good read. I'm just checking in on the chat. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> Dale mentioned uh, D- the Cowboys, so um, <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, Vanish number two. Uh, interested to see what you guys thought of this series uh, or this the second issue if you've read it yet. Um, I, there, there was a little. There's a little storyline about uh, September 11th, and the, you know, 9/11 and the World Trade Center. Uh, I need to go back and read this again. I was a little kind of thrown off by that being in the book, um, but interested to hear anybody else's thought on the on this second second issue. So. Um, did you read it, Comics by the Bay? Did you read issue two? Um, like I said, the the nine eleven reference kind of threw me off a little bit. I wasn't wasn't sure what to think of it, so I need to go back and and I want to reread it again because I was reading a bunch of books back to back. So I don't know. I I, I kind of felt a little. Uh, I wasn't sure about it. So um, yeah, definitely sub you sub sub everybody up. <laughs> So yeah, if you've read Vanish, let me know. Uh, Vanish too. So, um. <laughs> yes. Well, I mean, the books that you're pulling, Trev, from your fifty cent bins, uh, it's hard not to be addicted. You've been you've been pulling some crazy stuff. So, um. Okay. Yeah. Interested to hear it. So, um, I hadn't seen any other reviews as of yet. So, interested. Like I said, I want to go back and reread that the first couple pages, because they, like I said, the whole, there's a nine 11 reference that kind of, that kind of threw me off. So, um, yeah, that's true. Right. Yeah. One, one was a pretty good, uh, first issue, you know, set, set a bunch of stuff up. Um, so okay. Yeah. That's what I said. I didn't, I didn't want to kind of pass judgment on it. Um, and, and so I wanted to kind of go back and reread it and just kind of see, um, I was just a little shocked to, to see that there was a nine 11 reference in the world trade center stuff in there. Um, but like I said, I said, let me take a step back. Let me regroup, reread it and see. So, um, so, uh, moon Knight number, this is moon Knight 16. I can, wow. I can't believe we're already 16 issues in, um, you know, this was a pretty good read. Um, setting some things up, we've got some, you know, some, some vampires, uh, different factions of vampires, uh, in New York city and moon Knight is trying to get to the bottom of it. So that's been a pretty interesting, I have the, I know the annual just came out this week. Um, I'm waiting for it to get it in the mail. I heard that was a good read with uh, werewolf, uh, by night. So, um, definitely looking forward to that. Well, all right, everybody's subbing everybody up. Appreciate that. And then uh, I got two more books that I read this week. Uh, Carnage, Carnage number seven. I mean, look at this cover. This the the Carnage series has had some amazing some amazing covers. This is just crazy. Um, and so this whole arc has really been about um, Carnage. He is no longer um, tied to Cletus, and so he's kind of on a mission of building strength. Um, and they, they hinted at the end of this that, you know, he may be, he may be setting his sights on Venom. So who knows? Um, but that was, that was a pretty good read. <clears throat> yeah, I'm definitely, I've enjoyed Carnage so far. It's been a little slow. The last, the first couple issues really, really were done well. And now I think the last two or three issues are, have slowed down a little bit, but, you know, Carnage is kind of building this master plan. So. Um, and the, like the artwork, yeah, the artwork has been amazing. The covers have been, 
um, just crazy. Some of the covers. So, um, yeah, I saw that venom. You know, I, I've been, I've been reading venom and, uh, I'm not, I'm, uh, you know, venom is a book and the Hulk, the incredible Hulk are two books that are kind of on my chopping, a uh, chopping block right now. I'm not sure if I'm going to continue with those. I really haven't enjoyed them. Um, the Hulk is just con the whole Starship Hulk thing is just uh, it's just confusing and and hard to follow and you know I want to I want to have fun with the book and and not be like what piece of Bruce or Hulk is this it's kind of a little confusing so uh, I may I may drop that um, and the same thing with Venom I, I think Venom has been kind of blah for me as well so. Um, uh, okay. Yeah, that's true. We have all of the dark web, um, crossovers. Yeah. Hulk has been tough. Hulk has been a struggle. I've, I've tried to stay with it. I've tried to like it, but it's just, it's, it's been a little bit of a grind to, to read that. So uh, yeah. Uh, okay. All right. Maybe I need to stay with it. <laughs> Yeah, Dark Web is, um, there's a ton of cross crossovers, so I don't know how I feel about that. I obviously want to follow the, the Spider-Man storyline, but, you know, I just hate when there's all these, you know, crazy tie-ins. Um, so, yeah, Venom is kind of really kind of um, slowed down for me as well. And then the final book is Strange, number seven. This has been a really great series. Um, Clea as the Sor Sorcerer Su Supreme has really been good. And she's on a mission to try to find, you know, if she can bring uh, Steven back. And this is, this has been really good. Artwork is really good. Um, and the storyline has been really good. She's been really good as the, you know, the, as the main character. So um, that, that's been, that's been a fun read. And the only other book I think I have, uh, Phil, I owe you, uh, uh, I'm going to read uh, X-Men Green. And I, uh, so I'm going to, that's one other book that I had that I haven't read yet. So, um, well, I think we carnage could be leading up to something, uh, about that. So we'll, we'll see carnage and, and venom. I feel like we're going to get a crossover at some point. Um, so we'll see. Yeah. Strange has been really good. It's been one of my, I think mean, strange and moon Knight have really been, uh, you know, as well as you know, obviously Spider-Man, I'm a Spider-Man fan. I'll read Spider-Man, even if it's, you know, heart, hot garbage, I'll read it. But um, <laughs> I think Strange and Moon Knight have been my two, my two favorites. Carnage, uh, I think Carnage right up there too. Um, but uh, Carnage, the last couple issues have, have um, slowed down a little bit, but um uh, but I still have some books from this past week that are, um, on um on order i should have actually have them today um yeah i don't know i just felt like um you know the venom story too is a little there's a lot happening in the venom story um you know and i, I think it's partly because i'm reading so many different titles that sometimes it's when the story is really complex uh, it's it's tough to keep track of everything. <laughs> so, you know, I think that's why I'm trying to, um, you know, maybe cut back on a few issues that I'm reading. Yeah, Codex is back. Yeah. So. You, the She-Hulk the she -Hulk series, that's one that I've really enjoyed too. Um, the current run of She-Hulk. It's, it's kind because of, it's kind of a light read. So it's nice to have that balance of, you know, like a light, lighter storyline, plus then the, um, you know, the more, you know, crazy or complex storyline. So, um, well, Bor, good morning. Appreciate you being here. I'll have to check that out. Yeah, it definitely seems like in some of these storylines, you know, Carnage, Venom, you have the Daredevil, Daredevil and Punisher um, series that look like they're leading up to a big event, some, some maybe some crossover or, you know, some event happening between, you know, those two storylines. So there's definitely a lot happening, some some good storylines, um, you know, happening. So, 
Um, yeah, that's what that's what I like about She Hulk because it's kind of a light read. Um, and Jack of Hearts has been good. The characters that are in the story have been good. Um, but it's not, like I said, it's not like the Hulk or uh, Venom, which, like I said, is more of a complex story. And you're like, you have, you know, you have to think a little bit more when you're reading those those storylines. So, <laughs> yeah, I would agree. I would agree. The current run of She-Hulk is, is was definitely better than the show itself. So, ah, I appreciate that. Thank you. Thanks for stopping in this morning. Um, you know, I appreciate everybody who comes in and, and supports the channel. Uh, obviously couldn't do it, do it without you guys. So I really do appreciate that. Yeah. I, you know, I was entertained by the She-Hulk show. I think it wasn't, you know, it was a lot different than, than the other Marvel shows, you know, the breaking of the, of the four, fourth wall and the way, you know, the way they handled the, the show it was definitely different. Um, you know, I, I don't think people were ready for the more comedic side of the show, um, but it but it was okay. You know, overall, I thought it was was pretty good. They certainly used it to help move the Hulk story along, um, which was good to see. You know, the Hulk in it. Um, so it'll 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 be interesting to see. You know, the next, and I don't know what the next uh, Mar Disney Plus Marvel series is, but to see what the re you know the reaction is of of the next show. <laughs> uh no man daredevil's uh not you know not not around uh right now right he's not he's not in new york city anymore given his current uh storyline so um yeah and, and don't we have um don't we have another craven spider-man story coming up the lost hunt i think there's a there's a mini series or uh, some tie-in that's coming uh, coming up in the next couple months. I, th I thought I saw. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's so it's so it's so funny. It's it's like either people really love um, She-Hulk or hated it. There's like no in between. It's very it's been very extremes. Ah, okay, yeah, there you go, Phil. That's right. Yeah, Secret Invasion um, is the next ongoing, and then yeah, Garden. Guardians of the Galaxy, the holiday special. I haven't seen that trailer yet. I know it's out. I gotta go. I gotta go check that out. Um, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Appreciate that. Hit that like button. Evil Mike. Good morning, sir. Appreciate you being here. I know you were. I bailed out a journey stream last night at probably about eleven thirty, eleven forty-five. So I know you. Uh, I don't know how long he went last night, but I know you were in there. Yeah, I'm. I currently have, uh, you know. So I, I gotta, I gotta watch the Andor, Andor, the latest episode. So it's, you know, switching gears from Marvel, the Star Wars stuff. I have the um, Andor. I gotta catch up on, and then the Tales of the Jedi animated. So um, I gotta go check that out. Yeah, I thought I saw something. Let me let me do a quick search on it. Uh, I thought it was the lost called the lost hunt. Uh, the lost hunt. Yeah, so it's a five issue limited series um, that will dive into Craven's origin, revealing secrets, and answering mysteries Spidey fans have been waiting for. Uh, let's see. When does it come out? Um, early November. So yeah, I'm definitely excited for that. Six, um, six issue series. Um, Di Mateus is the writer and, uh, I don't know who the artist is, but yeah, so that's, that should be interesting. I always love the, the, the last hunt uh, was one of my favorite story um stories from spider-man so um yeah secret you know when you've got samuel l jackson back as as nick fury i i you know i think that's always something to look forward to so <laughs> uh <laughs> yeah 
Yeah, I don't know if that was the CGI or, or what. So, Jay, have a great uh, weekend. Rest of your Saturday. Appreciate you stopping in. Uh, all right. Let's see. Just making sure I'm not missing anybody. Chat. But, yeah, we're going to wrap it up soon. I know um, Phil Tastic has his show uh, on at 11, his live stream. So definitely go check him out. Um, Yeah, I got. I like I said, I haven't seen the trailer yet. Um, I heard it was good. So, um, Gene, have a great weekend. Yeah, I'm just catching up. I was way behind on the chat. Oh, nice. Oh, that's interesting, Kyle. Yeah, we'll have to check that out. Um, yeah, because that you know he like I said he's the writer of the. Um, of that new series. So yeah, yeah, I know I'm, I'm at, I know I think Andor has 12 uh, episodes. We're at uh, episode eight. So we got four more to go. Definitely looking to check that out. Really? That's interesting. Yeah, that last episode was a, a, certainly a um, a letdown. I, that was I, I didn't see that you know um, coming. You know, we had this big big battle going on, and then they cut to the yeah. It was kind of, it was kind of a strange way to end the show. Oh, okay. So inside inside stuff didn't uh, didn't didn't know that. It, Andor is definitely a slow burn, Phil. Um, there's, you know, the first couple issues are, uh, first ep first couple um, shows are a little slow, uh, but it definitely picks up. But it's it's more kind of a, you know, the forming of the rebellion. So it's a little bit of a political, you know, the different factions. So it, it it's definitely not, you know, lightsabers and and you know, <laughs> battles all the time. It's it's more of a, a slow you know, set up political type burn. So, uh, but a couple of the episodes, the later um, episodes definitely, definitely got good. Definitely some, some action going on. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we almost had that, right. We had, we had them all in the room together and then, then they cut away. So Jerry, good morning guys. Go check out Jerry. He's got a, a project on his hand. He's, he's working on a flash book, which is, He's got a lot of work to do, but he's he's the right man for it. So, all right, guys, we're going to wrap it up. Hope everybody has a great weekend. Go head over to uh, Phil's channel. A uh, couple minutes, he'll, he'll be going live. Uh, and then we have uh, definitely check out Rob Fatstacks and Chris. Uh, only slash, I don't think Chris is going to be hosting. I think actually Tylux might be jumping in with him this week. But he's moved the show from Saturday to Sunday, a very special Halloween version uh with dope comics so you definitely don't want to miss that dope dope's got some dope comics um <laughs> so but have a great weekend everybody i appreciate everybody coming out um hanging out and go go if you haven't go check out that 800 subscriber video and and sub up all those channels shop and and Durs and and cat fan uh zach collects so appreciate everybody uh, stop it in. Have a great rest of your weekend. All right. We've got 200 subscriber giveaway coming up. Yes. All right. Tylox is. That's what I thought. I thought I saw that in one of the group chats. So cool. That, that you'll definitely be, you're, you're definitely the right, uh, co-host for Rob and dope. Dope is, uh, dope is one of my favorite channels. Cause like I said, every time I watch his channel, I'm seeing books I've never seen before. Uh, and he's, he's entertaining as well. So <laughs> yep enjoy your halloween yeah have a great weekend everybody uh let's see we're gonna leave you with something what are we gonna leave you with what are we gonna leave you with hmm you know what we'll do we'll leave you with we'll leave you with the whack the whack comics guy since it's halloween they're a little spooky and, and crazy, all tied up in one. So we'll, we'll leave you with that. So 
Have a great weekend, everybody. Thanks for thanks for hanging out this morning. Oh my gosh, yes. Hi everyone, welcome to Whack uh, Comics. I'm here with my wanker as always. Yeah, hey, hi. On. We've also got a guest this week. <laughs> he wants to burn it. Hi. 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 Let's do our top three. Read this, this, and uh, Primordial Three was really good. I've got this one, and I've got the B cover, and this one, Suicide Squad. I refuse to do this, guys. This is stupid. Um, Tyler, are you ready? Yeah, I'm always ready. Each week, three, five, and five. Then this week, um, number one, we've got Spider Man, and number two, we've got Batman, and number three, I forgot it. So, are you ready for Daddy's toy shows? Yeah. Dad. Hi, Daddy. Hi, Daddy. Daddy has Invincible. Daddy has, Daddy the has thing. my Shimbu. It's time for Tyler's favorite segment. It was the me. I hate memes. Yeah. <laughs> we know. It was the me. Uh, we ask every guest. Uh, hey, is it takeable? The answer. The answer is always yes. Great. Okay. We have a whack axe. Warning. I made a trophy. I made an award. Yeah, guys, this is so disrespectful. Sorry, Brian. No, 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 no. That's all we have time for. We're going to let freak <laughs> Louis play as that as always. Bye bye. Thanks, Ignacio. You're still here? It's over. Go home.